What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. In this video I'm going to be talking about video games and my relationship with video games, my, my past history with them, and uh, why I don't play them today. So uh, yeah, it's just going to be a short video today. I thought I'd try to get it all done in, uh, in one short clip here. We're outside, it's a beautiful day out today, sunny, a little chilly. But uh, yeah, so to get, to get into it, um, when I was a child, that's when I first started playing video games. Uh, when I was probably like, I don't know, like 10 or 11 or something. I got into like the Game Boys. And then uh, as I got older, I got into the, the console systems. And so I played a wide variety of these uh, video games. But um, what became clear, well, looking back, it's clear uh, that I had a really addictive personality. And these, and these games were really addictive in amongst themselves. So I'd spend a lot of time on these games, uh, usually after school, but uh, sometimes later on in school, I got to, like with the portable devices, I'd bring it to school, and so I'd spend hours and hours in these games every day. And they just got really addictive. And uh, so yeah, it's just something that's interesting about video games is the better that you get in the games, the higher your level is or the skill or, or the better you get at them, uh, the worse you're going to get in real life because you're just essentially losing time. So the more that you play them, the, uh, the less time you have in real life to, to make yourself better in, in the real world. So less time you have to read or, or to exercise or to uh, strength train or run. So you can't, uh, you can't really develop, develop those skills because you're, you're busy playing these, these games. Um, so yeah, that was just one realization that I had that really, that really kind of stuck with me. And, um, and yeah, once I had that realization, it just became really, really difficult to continue to uh, justify to myself playing these, these video games. So I, uh, yeah, about in my, in my early 20s, I decided to sell all my uh, console systems, sell all my games, and I, I, don't, I don't play anymore at all. And I uh, haven't really looked back. So, um, so yeah, it's, it was just a really positive change. I just wanted to, to share it with you guys. Maybe some of you guys are struggling with, uh, with video game addiction yourselves. And uh, hopefully you could find this, uh, find this useful. Uh, something else that's important to note too with, uh, with video games is that uh, the, the time that you spend on them, you'll never get back. Uh, and, and looking back cumulatively, I've probably spent hundreds and hundreds of hours on these video games and, and I'll never get that time back. So just going forward, I just be sure to be smarter about my time and to make sure that I don't spend more time on those, on those video games. And some people will say like, yeah, but it has value in it because it's, it's fun playing these video games. You, you play with your friends and it's just a good time. And I can see that, but um, at what point there's this fun is, which is like a pro of it, but there's also a lot of cons that come with it, right? Like you're stationary, it's not too good for your health. And so you really gotta consider those things. So I will still have, sometimes I'll have fun with video games, but I just don't do it on my own time or by myself. I'll, I only really play video games today. If I go to a friend's house and they have a console and we all play together. And I find that's, uh, that's when I get my fun in with video games. But uh, yeah. No more video games for just me. And uh, yeah, that's it. That's just kind of my story about, about video games. Just wanted to share it with you guys. And uh, yeah, so that's, uh, that's about it. If you, uh, if you liked the video, please uh, let me know what you think about it in the comments below. Give it a like, subscribe to the channel. I'm entirely honest, I share the ways that I improve my life with the hope that it will help improve yours. Peace.